Mm-hmm. So there's a little bit of a beat down here. Uh, the Grosse Deutschland is uh, to be withdrawn. And that means that unit goes. And that unit goes. And the HQ goes. And there's a fourth unit somewhere. It's a motorized something or other. I need to find it. But they just come straight off the board. They go into the GD Grosse Deutschland box. And they don't come back until their GD returns to this pool. As you can see, there's already this turn because of the way the chit pulls worked. We had four German activations back to back, which was, you know, fabulous. And then funnily enough, three east, eastern section, uh, third Belarus front activations. And then we rolled this uh, random event, which was Stalin interferes. Otherwise, we would have had six 2BF, six uh, second Belarus front activations in a row. Because uh, when you pull something else, you just ignore it. And then you, you keep going until you get a unit, a, a chit that is required. At least that's how I think it works. <laughs> um, if it doesn't, then, you know, uh, we played it wrong. But anyway, we're having fun playing it this way. So... Uh, Four activations because of the die roll uh, instead of six for this uh, left wing over here really has opened up. You know, we pushed the fifth guard tank up deep. Uh, not going to worry about supply and all that sort of stuff right now. Um, banking on the fact that the you know we know the Germans can't move right now, so we're not too worried about being uh, put into out of supply mode or isolation mode. And we're just going to keep pushing hard. Hopefully these formations here won't get an activation. And if they do, not a whole lot those units can do. And in fact, we capture this town over here. So this might be, this might be the end for the Germans. Realistically, they only have uh, two, three, four uh, tank brigade, five tank brigades and this little infantry dude here that can move to protect this northern section of the map here, right? Uh, all of this stuff. And I'm sorry for waving the camera around. I know, I know I don't usually do that, but there you go. Anyway, pretty interesting situation. We're going to crank through the supply phase and, and make sure I've done that right. Double check the chip draw rules. And then we will uh, see if we play turn seven, which gives us a second... 2BF front uh, chip, which will be interesting. All right, guys.